kayak in a few days ago, good cleanup, and reinstalled the thigh braces that had come loose, and we're ready to go. Hey, Joe here. Saturday afternoon, October 24th. Just heading out for a little paddle in the sea kayak, heading down the river down to Lake Superior. Go for a little jaunt and back up. See you in a bit. Neebing River, 100 meters from the shop, and in the kayak, and we are ready to go. And here we're approaching the dam. This is about 700 meters down from the put-in. The put-in, of course, being about 100 meters from the house, slash the garage, slash the wood shop, battle shop. Water's at a nice level right now. You can just cruise right through the dam here, going downstream or upstream on the way back. Piece of cake. Right now we are about 4.3 kilometers from Lake Superior. So right now we're about one and two thirds kilometers, maybe 1.7 kilometers down from the put in. Just past a bridge. About a couple hundred meters from Caltrack Outdoors, where I used to work many years ago. I used to paddle down the river and portage to work. That yeah, was kind of cool. We're just winding our way down the river. We'll be at Lake Superior before long. Beautiful October fall afternoon for a little paddle. Paddling the Tahe Wind 585 Sea Kayak. It's a 19 foot 2 by 21 inches Kevlar. Had this kayak for 10 years. Got it when sponsored by Taihei Kayaks. We're well, getting ready to go around Vancouver Island for the speed record the second time back in 2010. Although I ended up using the Nigel Dennis Greenlander Pro for the first portion of the paddle. Switched over to this, laid in the paddle at Spino, and finished with it. Good times. Looking forward to next year and getting back out there again. Superior. Hope my camera is not screwed up because it looks like it might be. Time will tell. So straight ahead, that's the sleeping giant. I don't know if that's going to come out on this footage or not, but sleeping giant. And over here to our right will be Pie Island. Way out there. Okay, and here we're going along the Keller Island. Straight ahead is Mission Island. And there's a little channel in between, so I think we're going to go between the two islands, paddle around the Kelder, and then I'll be heading back for uh, for the McIntyre, Neebing, and on home. Let's do a little loop. I'm only planning on doing about 10 or 12 kilometers this afternoon. Just an impromptu little paddle. That looks like it's going to end up more like uh, 19 or 20. Why not? Nice day in October. I would have shot some more footage, but I was kind of worried about the camera, whether it was water damaged and even working at this point. So just a couple more photos that came out okay. Hopefully better next time. Hopefully the camera isn't damaged. Anyways, here's the kayak back home in the garage. Got everything hung up and things are drying out. And in the next couple of days, I'll try and get back out for another video, something a little bit longer and make it a little more fun. Talk to you soon. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks.